Hello, folks, and welcome back to the Vertigo Tea Party and Let's Play Wild Star. This episode of Wild Star, which I believe should be episode 100, is brought to you by Asger. Thank you very much, Asger, for your support on Patreon. I very much appreciate it. Now, I found this little quest over here. It looks like an instance. I think I can do it solo, kind of like that other one we did Why You Back When. We're going to give it a try and see how it goes. Even though it's a lower level one, I figured it'd be something a little different. That again, again, it's assuming I can actually do it. We'll find out very, very soon. I'm sure right off the bat we'll find out how possible this is. I wish it indicated these instances, like if, if there are one things that you could do, or are all the instances like that, are all the one, are all the instances soloable? I honestly have no idea. I honestly have no idea. Hello. Uh, looks blah blah. blah. Let's see, let's see and see what happened. Okay. Oh, uh, no, I don't want to leave. Oh, go this way. Everything looks fine. Major Lee Baharmi. You can't go in there. Something terrible happened in the lab. I barely escaped. Leave all you can. No, I'm good. I see red names. Guess we'll find out how nasty they are. Just over the, air the lock on the airlock for you. Do me a favor and don't come back through this unless you absolutely have to. Decreasing sanity. Look out for the gas filling. The ship is making you hallucinate. Keep an eye on the sanity meter to keep track your track your state. There's no telling what you'll see when you lose your marbles. Be on the lookout for the clean air tanks located around the ship. You can give you a clear-headed boost to stop you from descending into total madness. All right. Well, I'm glad they showed that before. Um. Not so bad so far. Ah. I fat fingered that one. I don't seem to be doing any serious damage, so I think we're alright. Double kill. I inform my crew about the real enemy, the pants. They no longer listen to my orders. Mutinous traitors! You know, you really cannot trust pants, that is true. Alright, we're gonna leave those for now. I guess we actually might need them here. What the? Guy just hanging out on the ceiling. Don't know a care in the world. I also finally did something I said I'm going to do for a long time. I put, uh, I put my hotkeys on my mouse keys. So I basically all I've, I just a little bit though. You don't quite feel like yourself. Hey, wait, what? Do I have to stand on it? Hmm. What's this data pad? I gave the chief science officer a go-ahead on starting up experiment X649. The chem lab is to be put up on quarantine for the duration of the experiment. Wow, I'm such a good reader. Oh, okay. It doesn't do it all the way. Oh, you do need to stand next to it. I mean, that makes sense, right? You gotta inhale it. You don't quite feel like yourself. Who do I Who do I feel like? I can feel like anybody. Who would I feel like? Johnny Depp? Oh, that's who if I could look like anyone, I guess, to be fair. Because what guy doesn't want to look like Johnny Depp? Well, probably Johnny Depp, because he already looks like Johnny Depp. And he's like, oh, I wish I looked like somebody else today. It's like, no, no, you don't. I'm also kind of trying to decide what I want to do for my last, for the last slot. Oh, yeah. What are you doing? What? Hello? Guess they're going crazy, too. Yeah. Why are the other crew members shrinking? My lamp tells me I'm hallucinating, but I don't believe him. Lamps are full of shit. Always giving their goddamn opinions. It's like, oh, you know what? If I wanted your opinion, lamp, I would have asked you. You know how many times I've asked for your opinion? Rarely. Spiders. Make sure to shoot the wrong way. Oh, spider kill. Spider kills, spider kills. Triple kill. You know what was one really good instance? Uh, instance of madness was uh, in EverQuest 1. There was this instance called. Oh my god, what was it called? This is a great story. Oh yeah. 
They're just great engines. I don't remember what it was called, but man, tell me, tell you what, dog. It was great. You're brilliant. Uh, this is actually pretty easy stuff so far. Of course, I'm going to say that now. Double kill. Double kill. I didn't see what you said, but I'm sure it was something crazy. But there was this great instance. Gragzen, that's what it was. Gragzen. End, not end. What the hell? Oh, don't be that way. Game. You know what? For that, you get this. Kind of blew something. It's gone. Yes, I killed it. So what are we doing in here anyway? I'll talk about Gregs in a minute. Our air, our air supply has been breached from inside the chem lab. There's nothing to do now but wait and accept our fate. The same fate of those trapped inside. Whoa. Looks like you got a seriously bloody nose. You might want to see medical about that. Oh, what's this? Oh, sweet. Little healing tro probe type deal. Oh, what are we doing in here? Six, eight, sa safe, eight panicked workers. And great, or get four of six pa uh, data pads. Which is optional. I gotta get used to using the mouse for this stuff. Whoa, hello. Don't fear the Reaper, I guess. Don't fear the Reaper. I can't really tell what these things are. Oh, it's dark in here. Maybe too dark. The eyes, can you feel them looking at you? Nobody seems to believe me. They keep worrying about some gas leak. I'll show them. Your eyes? Your eyes are freaking out about a gas leak? You need to keep them in charge. Let them know who's in charge, that is. But yeah, Gregzen, great instance. Uh, it was very interesting because I've never seen another game with an instance like it. What in the nine hells? All right, I'm not over you guys' shit already. Ooh, gigantic weird spiders, that's great. Oh my god, fucking really? But anyway, this instance was great. Oh my fucking god. Let's see if I can destroy them like really quick. Else they're just gonna keep attacking us. Oh my god. Angry flower pot. Hmm. Alright, well. Just keep on being angry. But anyway, Greg's in. So, it was very interesting because the mobs would look different to other different players. So, some players would see one mob, like one model, and then another players would see another mo uh, model, and they would have the same name, though. And you would get various effects. Like, for example, some of the mobs couldn't be uh, mez, mez, basically what they called mez in WoW. Would think of it as poly, like poly from WoW where you basically take a mob out of combat, but if you hit it, if you or if you do uh, damage to it, it immediately goes in combat. So you would have to switch, like with adds, right? Because in EverQuest, you really didn't want to have more than one mob running around at once. So a lot of times, especially when you first go in there, you're like, oh crap, this mob's unmezzable. And I'd say, uh, yo, this mob with the mushroom is is unmezzable. You need to tank this one. And he's like, "Which one's the mushroom?" There's none of these mobs have looks like mushrooms. What are you talking about? It was it was really neat. Whoa! What the hell? So wait, is there a respawn in here? Did I have the same discussion with myself the last time this happened? Probably. Feel quite delusional. 
yeah, Greg's in. Awesome instance. Oh, another thing of, of worth noting here. Another thing worth no. What the hell? No. Assist me, you jackasses. My god. Another thing uh, worth noting. Wildstar and, and Wildstar news. Is that mega servers are live now. So basically there's a PvE server and a PvP server for each region. Like, you know, America, Europe, whatever. This looks a little different than it did before. Now he's hanging out in fire. Sounds great. You don't feel quite like yourself. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. As I'm going delusional, stuff looks really crazy. That's pretty awesome, actually. Access the observatory deck computer. Was that in here? Where was it? Oh, is that it? I think I see it. Or oh, wait, was that up there? Is there stairs up there, or is that a different area entirely? Yeah, we gotta go back. But yeah, mega servers are live. I haven't really had the chance to see what the impact is. I don't really ever log into this game too much unless, you know, I'm recording it. I do, you know, pre stuff. You do, you know, I sell things on the auction house, all that. How did those other <laughs> things become unusable just because I right clicked that one? That's kind of weird. Here's the computer. I thought they were attacking shit again. Let's go ahead and blow them up. You kill the little furry things. Good. Furry spiders are the best. Slightly less horrifying. Actually, I like spiders. The records indicate that there was a catastrophic failure on the environmental safeguards during a recent experiment. Ah, oh, shipwrecks. The, the lab safeguards failed? If I were you, I'd get myself to the lab and get a hazmat suit to protect your, myself, you bet. I will after I kill this person. He probably means well, but has to die regardless. But yeah, I'll be, I'll be interested once we start running around to see if uh, to see if there's more people just running around these areas. I did go to a loom to check on a few things, but and there is there are still people there. It's about the same number of people that's normally there. Sweet blessed navigator, you made it to the lab. There's bound to be hazmat suits somewhere thereabouts. Try the closet. And I know I keep saying this, but it still never ends to amuse me that me as a robot has to get a hazmat suit at all. Where's the hazmat suits? Whoa, I thought I saw some enemies. I wonder if you stay fully sane if the enemies aren't around. Whoa. When you open the closet, the control panel explodes violently. As the smoke clears, the laboratory seems different. Madness tugs at your senses. <laughs> Blazing crewman. This is 420. It's 420 somewhere. Oh, dude. Whoa. Double kill. Yeah, I, for my late eighth slot right now, I have mortar strike. I'm gonna fart around with that a bit. See how it goes. Seems to do pretty good damage, actually. Whoa. Welcome to my nightmare. Like, more efficient than electrocute? I don't know, but it definitely uses up a lot of What? What the? Time for a refreshment, you son of a bitch. <laughs> wow. Oh shit, he's angry at me. I don't know 
I mean, it seems like he'd be good if he's spitting out his delicious liquid all over my face. Like a Mountain Dew Bakake. Mom, what's a Bukake? No, don't ask your parents that, please. The eyeball kind of takes away the horror. Ooh. Are you drinking your own soda to get health? You're, you're drinking your own juices to get health back. That's effed up. Pull tab to open up. Wow. This is actually pretty cool. I'm glad I did this mission. Uh, it's pretty neat. To be fair, I haven't been paying as much attention into the goings-on as I should have been, because I've been busy yapping at you people. But it's still been pretty damn cool. <laughs> Robot and hazmat. Patched and space-worthy now. Ship out to engineers and activate their air scrubbers. Only we'll, way we'll save this boat. You'll have the chance of livestock... You'll have the chance of livestock pens first. Watch yourselves, eh? Hallucinating Q-Pig. You know, those Venture fellas are going to be in trouble when they activate the air scrubbles. Scr scrubbles? Scrubbles have witches. Oh, what? what the hell am I on about? Meow. I'm sorry, little animals. I'm sorry that I have to do this. Bam. You'll be good blitz in heaven. Ah! Would you know my name? Oh. Oh! Speaking of auction house, check out my money. Look at that. Look at that. Let me open it. Look at that. A platinum. So, remember one of those items that I got? Uh, I think it was like uh, the purple guns. They sold for like 50 gold. It was awesome. Kill it with fire. No, my friend. You're simply delirious. I've got to stop using the damn uh, potion thing or whatever you want to call it. When I'm in the middle of casting something since it interrupts. Rampaging Drixian. Oh. Why would I take damage from that? Like from his butt. I'll switch my gun out too. Oh shit. I'm in the red. Yeah, where is it? Looks pretty nice actually. Uh, Dog Finder's minigun. I don't remember if I got this for a quest or if it was a random pickup. But. Looks pretty sweet. I like it. One of the better looking guns I think we've gotten. Look at all them crits. Let's go ahead and kill this person. I don't know why we bother saving the hallucinating workers. They're always going to get pissy about it. Thanks for saving me, now die! Double kill. Hello. Give air helmets to hallucinating workers. Oh, wait a minute. So wait, am I doing this by knocking them, beating them down? I haven't really paying it. Nope, that guy turned into little meat, little meat things. It says I'm 55% done. There you go. The hallucinations has vanished. Thank goodness. I don't think it works like that. I don't think you immediately stop hallucinating. Mildly funny story. So I had to have some tooth teeth work, tooth work done, teeth work done, tooth work done. You did a good thing trying to save those venture fellows. Shame you couldn't save them all. You did what you could. Damn it! But it wasn't enough. If only I tried hard. Oh God, that hurts. <laughs> My throat's a lot better, but I still can't do stuff like that very well. Not at long links. Damn it! Stop running all over the place doing your weird pathing. 